Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. So first question is which of the following disease is caused by vitamin B1 deficiency options are rickets pernicious anemia beriberi or scurvy and the right option is beriberi so let's discuss the various deficiency disease caused by the vitamin deficiency first here is the vitamin b1 this vitamin b1 deficiency develops very very b2 riboflavin develops glossids niacin b3 deficiency develops pellagra pyridoxin b6 develops anemia cyanocobalamin b12 deficiency develops pernicious anemia folic acid b9 develops anemia pantothenic acid develops burning feet b7 biotin develops nerves disorder ascorbic acid that is vitamin c deficiency develops scurvy retinol vitamin a deficiency develops eye and skin disease night blindness xerophthalmia rupture of cornea next calciferol vitamin d deficiency develops rickets or fragile bones vitamin e or tocopherol deficiency develops fertility disorder next phylopinol vitamin k deficiency develops blood clotting next question question number 2 the amino acid arginine can be best identified by options are hopkins test sakaguchi test millens test all of the above and the right option is sakaguchi test the heterocyclic ring that is present in alprazolam and the options are 1 2 3 triazole 1 3 4 triazole 1 2 4 triazole or 1 2 4 imidazole and the right option is 1 2 3 triazole let's have a look on the structure of the alprazolam this is the structure of alprazolam here in this red circle it's denote the 1 2 4 4 triazole ring this is the 1 2 4 4 triazole ring next question question number 4 what is the name of india's first indigenously built aircraft options are vikrant sakti vayu or virat and the right option is vikrant so the vikrant class formula project 71 air defense ship that is known as ads or indigenous aircraft carrier iac is a class of aircraft carrier being built for the indian navy and the class represents the largest warships and the first aircraft carries to the design and built in india next question question number 5 selective cox2 inhibitors are options are celecoxib indomethacin naproxen or diclofenac and the right option is celecoxib let's have explanation of this question different class of the nasads so there are basically three classes firstly classified non selective cox inhibitor these all class are the non selective cox2 inhibitor next preferential cox2 inhibitor and selective cox2 inhibitor so non selective cox inhibitor first salicylate derivative aspirin sodium salicylates salicylamide these are the next paraminophenol acetaminophen phenyl acetic acid diclofenac etorolac oxycamps piroxicam 
पायराजोलोन डेरिवेटिव फिनाइल ब्यूटाजोन ऑक्सीफेन ब्यूटाजोन प्रोपियोनिक एसिड डेरिवेटिव आइबोप्रोफेन कीटोप्रोफेन नेक्स्ट फेनामेट्स में फेनमिक एसिड फ्लू फेनमिक एसिड एंड द प्रिफरेंशियल कॉक्स टू इन्वेटर आर द निमोसोलाइड मिलॉक्सिकैम नेबोमिटोन एंड द सेलेक्टिव कॉक्स टू इन्वेटर्स आर द सेलिकॉक्सिल प्रोफेकॉक्सिल पैराकॉक्सिल एंड द वेल्टेकॉक्सिल दीज आर द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द नॉन स्ट्राइडल एंटी इन्फ्लामेटरी ड्रग्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स अकॉर्डिंग टू आई पी द परसेंट वेट वेरिएशन फॉर द ड्रग हैविंग वेट मोर देन टू फिफ्टी एम जी एंड ऑप्शन आर प्लस माइनस टेन परसेंट प्लस माइनस फाइव परसेंट प्लस माइनस सेवन पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट एंड द डी ऑप्शन प्लस माइनस फिफ्टीन परसेंट एंड द राइट ऑप्शन इज फाइव परसेंट सो लेट सी द वेट वेरिएशन डिफरेंट स्केल अकॉर्डिंग टू द आई पी सो इफ द टेबलेट एवरेज वेट एवरेज वेट इज लेस देन एट टी एम जी देन टेन परसेंट डेविएशन विल बी अलाउड एंड इफ वेट इज एट टी एम जी टू टू फिफ्टी एम जी सेवन पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट डेविएशन विल बी अलाउड एंड इफ मोर देन टू फिफ्टी एम जी वेट ऑफ द एवरेज टेबलेट देन ओनली फाइव परसेंट डेविएशन विल बी अलाउड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन करेक्टरिस्टिक्स अनवॉन्टेड रिएक्शन विच इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू अ डोज और टू अ फॉर्मोकोडाइनमिक प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ अ ड्रग इज कॉल्ड एडियोसिंक्रेसी हाइपर सेंसिटिविटी इंटॉलरेंस और टेराटोजेनिक एक्शन एंड द राइट ऑप्शन इज हाइपर सेंसिटिविटी सो लेट्स सी द डिफिनीशन ऑफ ईच ऑप्शन हियर सो फर्स्ट एडियोसिंक्रेसी वॉट इज एडियोसिंक्रेसी Idiosyncrasy. It is genetically determined abnormal reactivity to a chemical, and the drug interact with some unique feature of the individual not found in majority of subjects, and produces the uncharacteristic reaction. So this is not common, and this basically depend idiosyncrasy basically depend on the genotype of the patient. Next, teratogenicity. it refers to the capacity of a drug to cause fetal abnormality when administered to the pregnant mother the placenta does not constitute a strict barrier and may drug can cross it to a greater or lesser extent the embryo is one of the most dynamic biological system and in contrast to adults drug effects are often irreversible means when any drug induces or develops any side effects in the infants inside the placenta then that is the teratogenicity next intolerance it is the appearance of characteristic toxic effect of a drug in an individual at therapeutic dose it is the converse of tolerance and indicates a low threshold of the individual to the action of drug next hypersensitivity what is the hypersensitivity characteristic unwanted reaction which is not related to a dose or to a pharmacodynamic property of a drug so this is the hypersensitivity question number 8 elated is to despondent as enlightened is to aware ignorant miserable or tolerant and the right option is ignorant next question question number 9 in pasteurization milk is heated to options are either 72.8 degree celsius for 30 minute or 71.6 degree centigrade for 15 seconds second option either 98 degree centigrade for 15 minute or 65 degree centigrade for 15 second third options either 100 degree centigrade for 15 minutes or 80 degree centigrade for the 15 second and d options none of the above and the right option is a either 72.8 degree centigrade for 30 minutes or 71.6 degree centigrade for the 15 seconds next question question number 10 an alkaloid present in opium and having a smooth muscles relaxant effect is options are morphine 
पेपेवेरी कोडीन निक नारकोटेन एंड द राइट ऑप्शन इज पेपेवेरी ओपियम इट कंटेन द केमिकल कंस्टिट्यूएंट्स और मॉर्फीन कोडीन पेपेवरीन एंड नारकोटीन मॉर्फीन इज एनालजेसिक इन नेचर कोडीन यूज इन द कफ सिरप पेपेवरीन हैव द स्मूथ मसल रिलैक्सन प्रॉपर्टी एंड नारकोटीन यूज इन द प्रिपरेशन ऑफ कफ लेक्टर यू कैन रेफर फॉर्माकोग्नोसी बुक बाय द सी के कुकाटी फिफ्टियथ एडिशन पेज नंबर फिफ्टीन पॉइंट फोर टू सो लेट्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर इलेवन द फर्स्ट इंडियन स्टेट टू गो होली ऑर्गेनिक एज ऑप्शन आर मेघालय सिक्किम मणिपुर और केरला एंड द राइट ऑप्शन इज सिक्किम नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व Which of the following is an intensive property? Options are temperature, surface tension, viscosity. All of these, and the right option, all of these. So, what is the intensive property? Have a look. An intensive property is one that does not depend on how much material is present, while extensive property. is one that does depend on the amount of substance intensive property example temperature if a beaker of water has a temperature all the water has the same temperature it does not depend on how much water there is and others intensive property includes with density chemical potential viscosity electrical resistivity specific heat capacity melting point boiling point and pressure and while the example of the extensive property are the energy mass volume weight and length next question question number 30 what is protein content of spirulina and the options are 20 to 30% percent, 70 to 90% percent, 50 to 70 percent or 90 to 100 percent, and the right answer is 50 to 70 percent. Let's have an explanation of this question. Here are the different food and their protein composition. Tofu have the 8 percent, red meat have 27 percent protein by weight, beef have 26 percent, pork. Have 27 percent, spirulina have 50 to 70 percent, cheese 25 percent, egg 13 percent, fish have 22 percent. Next question, question number 14. For what golden rice were promoted? Options: vitamin D, vitamin A, vitamin E, or vitamin C. and the right option is vitamin a what is the golden rice golden rice is rice that has been genetically engineered to produce high levels of beta carotene the precursor to vitamin a it was first developed by two academic scientists in the europe in 1990s and has attracted significant attention and controversy since then golden rice gets its name because the high level of beta carotene make it at a golden yellow color beta carotene is found in many fruits and vegetables for example it's what makes carrot and sweet potato orange next question question number 15 for temporary filling of dental cavity what material is used options are magnesium carbonate zinc oxide zinc carbonate or aluminum oxide and the right option is zinc x oxide how this filling occurs have a look filling of cavity to treat a cavity your dentist will remove the decayed portions 
of the tooth and then fill the area on the tooth where decayed material once left. Filling are also used to repair cracked or broken teeth and teeth that have been worn down from misuse such as nail biting or tooth grinding. Zinc oxide used in all cement that is IRM is a low strength base used as temporary cement filling in the event that the patient will return at a later date for a semi-permanent restoration. The powder is mainly zinc oxide and the liquid is used in all with olive oil as a plasticizer. Here you can see this is the zinc oxide filling in the teeth.